Again, so I'm going to show you the Maxi Elite, but before I show you the Maxi Elite, you would have just watched about the actual Maxi. Before I show you the Maxi Elite, I just want to show you behind is our factory. So I am standing in the middle of the road. It's beautiful downtown South Moolumbah. We're only about 20 minutes from the actual um, uh, Gold Coast Airport and probably about 40 minutes from the actual Gold Coast, about an hour and a half from Brisbane, about two hours from the Sunshine Coast. But if you want to actually come to the Food Trailer King and saw, see all our range, this is the place to do it because you'll see everything, be able to touch and feel everything and so on and so forth. So let's go over to the, um, the Maxi Elite, which conveniently I've placed in the middle of the actual street. That's our factory there. You see we've got a pretty good big setup. It's actually quite quiet today. We've got Burrell next door and a whole heap of other businesses down there. And um, literally it is like a ghost town on the weekends, but during the week it's super busy. Now, this is conveniently for your convenience, placed in the middle of the street, the actual uh, Maxi Elite. So. If we go through each part, okay, just be clear, the Maxi has less things in it, essentially, than the Maxi Elite. First, you've got your super strong chassis and so on and so forth, just like in the actual um, Maxi, okay? Now, under here, you'll see all the tanks and so on and so forth. Your grey water tank, your fresh water tank is up the front there, okay? Um, the downside of being on the asphalt is that it hurts your knees a bit when you're going down. Anyway, um, over and above that, this has mechanical brakes. A lot of people think, do I need electric brakes, etc., etc. Up to two tons. So this uh, trailer weighs just on 1,200 kilos as it sits now with everything I showed you. Okay, so it's actual loaded capacity. So the maximum capacity and go is two ton. So that gives you 800 kilos of um, carrying capacity, which is a lot of capacity. Like you'd be flat out putting 800 kilos in there to be honest with you. Okay, so first and foremost, one of the most important things is. Your gas work has to be actually certified. Now, it doesn't have the actual plate on there. Normally it has a plate, but this is all properly certified gas work that's put in by a proper gas fitter. You can see so you can put your two um, um, bottles on there, so you're sort of good to go in that regards. Um, as per, you'll see me talking about in other videos, we've got multiple inlets here, okay? Each one of these is a 15 ounce circuit. By the far, the best way of running uh, your electrical, simply because uh, you can run, like so you can literally plug it in and plug it in at an event or where you've got power, you might be at home. Um, one circuit will run the fridge, the hot water, um, the lights and so on and so forth. And then this other circuit will run a high current electrical equipment, like for example, a coffee machine, or um, there's another circuit here you could use for an oven or whatever. But this one's additional, this is sort of standard, but we, we talk about that and I'll sort of refine that and make sure everything trailer is right. It sort of happens in the background without you even knowing because the main thing is we want an easy of use and when you're out there talking to your friends and other people that have food businesses, they ask you where you got the food trailer from, you say Food Trailer King, you're totally happy with everything. We don't, we, we want you to refer, okay? Um, so that's basically a very, very quick run down the outside. Of course, you've got your gas struts and so on and so forth. So we'll walk around and actually go inside and have a look inside the actual trailer, okay? So first of all, um, with the Maxi Elite, what we've done is upgraded quite a few things, okay? So you've got the upgraded floor. This is the non-slip floor. The councils absolutely love this floor, okay? Then over and above that, and if you're worried about the big step there, there's little steps that we can give you that you can come in with. We've actually got a second fridge freezer in here, okay? So we've added that. So in the Maxi, it normally only has one. We've now got two, okay? Over and above that as well, we've actually got a drinks fridge. Now this drinks fridge isn't screwed in at this point in time, but it gives you extra fridge capacity because this one here, you can turn it up or down to wherever. All this stuff, we've got 12 months warranty, so you don't have to stress about warranties. We don't do things like try and change the, the name of um, fridges. We leave the original manufacturer's um, name on there so you know where it actually come from. We don't try and pretend it's something else, okay? All this stuff, um, no problems with warranties. now. Your, um, your actual um, um, sinks and so on and so forth, your double bowl and then your single bowl. Once again, as I've discussed before, you can put this however you like it. So essentially to comply with council regulations, they like to know that it's safe with a splash guard. This one in particular, we put a um, three-sided splash guard so you don't have any issues with council. Once again, people are all worried about council, like think it's a big problem. It's really easy, we'll take you straight through the process. Once you become the customer, it's very, very simple. Obviously, every trailer has to comply. We know all the things and all the different councils because we've had trailers all over different councils. Now, 
You would have saw it previously in the Maxi the six burner, okay? And you would saw it in the super size, the four burner. Most people are going for these four burners. You can have a two, four, or six. It's pretty much the same price, your choice, right? Um, over and above that, this has been left open in case you wanted to add other machinery in here. Uh, anything else, you could put a chip warmer. You can put an extra griddle. Some people would like a second griddle here. Um, you can add whatever you want, no problems whatsoever. Um, then you come down to the gas griddle. Now, you'll see that we've actually mounted this up higher. Now, the reason why we mount this up higher, nice and easy to clean underneath for yourself, okay? Then plus over the top, it's easier. It's a nicer height to work at. Now, over and above that as well, you'll notice the gas work in here. This is not actually connected up, this particular one, but when it is, that's why there's no plate on there on the front of it. When it is, it's all, that's when we put the plate on, it's all certified. The gas works all 100% right and it's all good to go, but this is not, not hooked up yet, right? And neither is the um, gas deep fry. Um, important thing, we've got the emergency shutoff valve. So this is very important. It's all part of your registration that we do for you. The stainless steel backing here, we put this uh, as an um, upgrade for you. Okay, it's all part of the, the Maxi Elite, okay? Then, probably one of the biggest things we do, we actually take the um, gas, uh, the electric deep fryer, remove that and put a uh, gas deep fryer in. Now, your recovery rate is so much better, your capacity is so much better. As you can see, you've got two decent sized basket there. Nice, brand new gas deep fryer. Now, um, as I show you on the super size video, super, super, super easy, right? With the Maxi Elite, you simply open that up, okay? There's a valve right here. Simply screw that in so when you're ready to go, you literally empty your oil out and then you can use your oil next time or recycle it or whatever you need to do, okay? This goes down, so all the oil comes out nice and easy. Obviously, please don't try it when it's hot. And then just, that just sit, basically sits straight on top there. So all pretty straightforward and easy. Once again, um, as I cover off in other trailers, there's cupboards everywhere, all right? So this, you can put your oil in, or you can put other bits and pieces in. One of the most important things you must understand, you'll see trailers around the place that don't actually have any cupboards, essentially. Um, they've got a bench and legs and that's it. It becomes a massive, massive problem when you're trying to travel. Um, you really need to have cupboards so it stops stuff flying around. If you remember with a food trailer, it's like um, a caravan or a camper van. You pack it up and you unpack it. It doesn't take long to set it up. It's really, really fast and away you go, okay? You've all, all got your um, shatterproof um, low voltage LED lights, okay? So when you're running a circuit, one circuit of this van, the way this van's hooked up at this exact point in time, Gas work, gas work, gas work. So zero power obviously involved there, okay? So it makes it the best way possible, okay? That's why we created the Maxi Elite. Then, uh, fridge, bay-marie, fridge, um, um, uh, display fridge, and then down here, underneath here, of course, we've got our normal hot water system, okay? That will all run off one generator, okay? You've also got your little jack in here. Bits and pieces we always add in. Some stuff I don't even tell you about, and then people get surprised and go, wow, this is good. I just had a customer here earlier and was just absolutely amazed at the quality of the trailers. He'd been, he'd been looking around and saw the, the quality of our trailers, okay? Because it takes a lot of effort um, to get it right, okay? So um, everything is basically set up, um, good to go. As usual, some people laugh at me. First, you're probably laughing at me for setting up in the middle of the road, right? Um, second of all, you're probably laughing at me because I'm gonna show you again the easy, super easy drop down jacks and these wind up and down. Nice and easy, so it doesn't matter who you are. I'll just get the little handle for it. We obviously include the handle for you. So if, if there's one lady by herself setting up, it's super easy, you just wind it up. It's virtually no effort at all. It's slowly winding up, okay? Um, the trailers are really well balanced. Actually, the customer that was here before was actually saying, holy crap. I got inside other trailers, they flip up. Yours are well balanced, they don't even flip up and he's in one of the smaller trailers, right? So that goes down and then to stabilize it, you just turn that and then you just literally wind it down super, super easy and just put a little bit of weight on it. It's no problems whatsoever. You can actually lift the entire trailer off the ground if you want to, there's really no need. And then when you're done, it's like that. So don't get caught out with um, cheap and nasty other versions, okay? Um, just other little things that we do. Part of your gas, um, your gas certification is, for obviously everything has to be Australian standards. You'll see here, this vent obviously runs through both sides. That's the safety thing, because um, to have it properly certified for gas, it's got to have vents, so in case of a gas leak, it can come out, and obviously the emergency shutoff valve as well. Over and above that as well, we add these vents. 
this allows the, the fridge to actually breeze and allows it to um, stay a lot cool, especially on hot days as well, okay? Um, that really, really helps. Your Bain Marie and so on and so forth, and of course your gas work. Your electrical is all certified. We'll probably shoot back around here because some people wonder, is it to a strange sense? It's all, there's a lot of things, unless you realize, unless you know in advance, that's why the whole goal is to educate as much as possible, okay? Unless you know in advance, you don't understand. So this, for example, that's all being tested and tagged by an electrician, okay? So we know that the actual, um, the electrical system is um, safe because it's all been signed off by an electrician, everything's been checked and so on and so forth. There is really a lot of effort that goes into um, sorting out all these trailers. You'll see over here, the factory that I've got, it's not a small setup. There's, you play a dangerous game shopping purely on price okay because you better pay a little bit extra even if you have to put it on finance to make sure you got the proper 12 months warranty make sure that someone's invested this money for an actual setup make sure that you've got covers under your benches make sure that everything's going to run and i'll take the time after you've watched this video to go through questions and so on and so forth with you to make sure it's all clear okay so if we spin back around into our nice empty street and like really there is no one traveling around because it is actually um saturday this is the Maxi Elite, so it's a step up from the Maxi. So you can get the Maxi as it sits, or you can upgrade to the Maxi Elite. In a summary, over and above the actual Maxi, the stainless steel backing it's got. It's got a second fridge freezer in there. It's the electric deep fryer has been changed to an actual gas deep fryer, and it's got the um, above bench. Um, it's got the above bench um, um, drinks fridge. It's a whole heap of extra stuff. So it's about roughly all that adds up to give or take around about um, um, six grand, okay? Which is not a lot extra to pay for an extra fridge. Even those fridges are a couple, uh, two and a half grand a piece, you know what I mean? If you've got any more questions or you need to know anything else, um, go to office at foodtrailerking.com.au. Just drop us an email, say, hey Matt, I've watched the video, I've watched the DVD. I wanna know a bit more, can you contact me? Um, I need finance or whatever. Um, or you can uh, go to foodtrailerking.com.au forward slash step three, there's a little form you can fill out underneath there, okay? Uh, or you can just give us a call and we'll basically go through any other questions you got, then we'll get it underway. Um, these days we just take a $100 refund or deposit, put in your system, raise your invoice, send it out, give you a chance to sort your finances out, any other questions and so on and so forth. Then we do a 50% payment, put everything in production, and when it's ready to go, you make your final payment and then you pick it up or we get it delivered, send it anywhere in Australia, it's really no problems. Like I said, we've got a pretty good setup behind. Um, hope that helped you and hope that explained the difference in between the Maxi and the Maxi Elite and all these different things that we spent a lot of time doing, hey? Really, really a lot of time uh, doing to make something just right for you. So when you're out in sight, um, um, talk, talking to people, you're saying, hey, the food trailer king looked after us. And ironically, not only in the middle of the street, it's raining now as well. So instead of standing in the rain, I'll stand under here and say goodbye and I'll um, see you in the next video.